three contentious bills were in the news once again this week. The women's reservation bill had been derailed a number of times by a boisterous and unruly MPs belonging to the Samajwadi and RJD parties. Last week, a physical tussle between the Trinamul Congress leader Mamta Banerjee and the Samajwadi MP Daruga Prasad Sarod had forced the speaker to adjourn the Lok Sabha for the entire day. However, with the left front and the Congress party declaring its support, the law minister Mr. Thambi Durai finally managed to table the bill in the Lok Sabha, despite pandemonium created by opponents of this legislation. Critics were, however, skeptical whether this crucial bill, which promises 33% reservation of all Lok Sabha and state assembly seats to women, would actually get passed in this session of parliament. Commentators argued the Prime Minister, Mr. Vajpayee, went ahead with the introduction of the bill to assert his authority and to send out the image that he was more than willing to take on the radical elements in his party when it came to decisions regarding governance. <laughs> However, the Congress, which had sent out signals that it supported the bill, succumbed to pressures from within its own party men and agreed to have the bill sent to a joint select committee of parliament. Congress leaders claim that they did so because they had differences of opinion with the BJP on specific provisions in the bill. Observers criticized the delay in the passage of this bill, which would have ensured investments of billions of dollars in the infrastructure sector. Analysts contend that what is significant is that the introduction of these bills also reflects a major shift in the ideological contours within the BJP. However, some experts feel that in the aftermath of the RSS Chintan Baitak or introspection session held recently in Nagpur, the battle between the hardliners and the moderates in the BJP has only just begun. But the moot question is whether the parliament session will be extended to ensure passage of these crucial bills.